It's an amazing city, obviously the biggest populated city in the US, 400 years or so of history. It's going to be quite the spectacle and it's a great place to have a ride cup. I have such an amazing relationship with New York. I went to college here, I fell in love with the city and I just love New York. I love the energy of it, I love the atmosphere, I love the mentality the people have. Um, it's just an exciting place to be. New York is a city that's known for its energy, its enthusiasm, it's a great sports town. Madison Square Garden, Yankee Stadium, all these places are iconic venues to come play in and for us to be able to go to Bethpage public golf course and play for the Ryder Cup is really special. I, you know, I think it's easily one of the greatest venues we can play on. Beth Page brings major championship venue with a enthusiastic crowd. So you combine those two things, you have a recipe for an unbelievable event. It's a beautiful piece of land, you know, this massive park and, you know, just outside the city in Long Island. Five courses, and obviously the black being the famous one because it's, it is a difficult golf course. It's a big golf course. I can host major championships. It's going to present uh, the golfers with, you know, a, a good challenge. And, uh, you know, it's going to be fun to have a Ryder Cup be hosted there. I think that this Ryder Cup has the ability to be one of the best, if not the best ever. <laughs> Keegan and I go way back. We've been friends for a long time. Um, we live a couple miles away from each other. We practice at the same golf courses down in South Florida. Luke is a guy that I love hanging out with. I love having a couple drinks with. He's a, he's a fun guy. I really, really love Luke Donald, and it <laughs> sucks. I hate it. I love you too. Uh, it's nice to share a journey with someone that you know uh, and get along well with. I think it's going to make the jobs a little bit easier. We did it. For me, it's really great to do all this stuff with Luke. And, you know, we both want to beat each other really bad, but we both, you know, have a lot of respect for each other and are going to go about this the best way that we can. But we certainly want to go, you know, win the Ryder Cup in a year. I'm excited. It's uh, nice to go up against someone so competitive, um, but also uh, someone that I consider a friend. Please welcome from Vermont, by way of Palm Beach Gardens, Florida, Keegan Bradley. It's nerve wracking a little bit, especially when you're representing someone other than yourself. You're representing the United States and the, and the boys on the team. So, you know, you really have to choose your words carefully and it's a big moment. I mean, you want to say all the right things, but you know, it's exciting at the same time. That moment when we won in Rome was the highlight of my career. It's certainly nice to be going, having a second term, so to speak. Uh, I think, you know, certainly a lot of learnings that I, that I would have got from, from Rome that will continue for, for this Ryder Cup. In a tough environment, uh, we will be the underdogs. Keegan, are you buying that? <laughs> <laughs> I really try to, at this point in my career, take more things in. And, you know, it's easy to do a lot of these functions and just move on. But I think, you know, this venue, being in New York City, doing all this is really special. You get to see uh, different parts of the city and have access to, to do certain cool things. I remember, obviously, in Rome to be able to wandering around the Colosseum and, and do some of that stuff that we did was pretty surreal. I think we've got some kind of golf shot. Um, planned with an amazing backdrop and uh, it'll be fun to, to be a part of that. I love coming to New York. I always love coming to New York, but this past week has been really special and fun for me and my family and something that I'll remember forever. Being here is a reminder that, you know, we got some big things coming and this is sort of the kickoff of the Ryder Cup. Things tend to move a lot quicker now. You know, things have already started to move with the qualification criteria, but you know, I just feel like you know, each and every week comes very quickly and the, and the countdown is really on now. So it's, it's, a, it's a fun time for me and uh, I'm excited for the, yeah, the next 52 weeks to play out. Lovely. thank you. To watch another Ryder Cup video, click here. To subscribe, click here.